Hey everybody, I'm Sarah Blaskovich. This is Evan Grant, and we are here at Globe Life Field. This is my first time here. Evan, how many times have you been? Millions. Uh, yeah, this is like no big deal. No, they do no, a dog and pony show every two weeks, so well, I come out here. And fans haven't been here yet, but Evan, as you know, is the Rangers writer, and he gets to come a whole lot. I am the food writer for the Dallas Morning News. I don't get to come a whole lot, but today is a very special day. We're going to try five of the new concessions items here at the ballpark. Uh, and I think every food tastes better when you eat it in air conditioning, so uh, that's going to be <laughs> that's going to be helpful. We are going to start with the Rattler. That's this. This is rattlesnake sausage. Rattlesnake is a real snake. So this is, you're actually eating ground snake meat uh, in this thing. Uh, what do you think about that? Um, and it's served. You, you feel good mention, about that? You need to mention that it's served with, I think it's Venmo sauce. Uh, yeah, Venom, Venom sauce. Oh, I thought it was Venmo. <laughs> Venmo sauce, I, you I got wish. Some money. If only you could get money. Okay, My I'm Venmo gonna, could use it. Here, I told Sarah I was gonna throw a curveball today, and so here's the curveball. Okay. I'm not going near this snake. You're not eating this? Here's here's the deal I've made with the animal kingdom. Oh no. Um I'm deathly afraid of snakes. Yes, me too. Um, and I respect greatly the shark. <laughs> so I've made a deal that I am not gonna taunt the snake by eating him. Oh gosh, so uh, this is up to me because I will totally eat. I'm also afraid of snakes, but I will absolutely eat snake. I'm going to watch you and, and admire. Okay. And okay. I may take a bite of the of the uh, roll just so, so I can participate. So you would be shocked to hear that it just tastes like pork sausage. I'm sure it does. It's, um. oh, he's doing it. No, I just took a bite of the roll. Oh, he didn't do it, okay. Yeah, so this is this is a sausage, um, everybody. If you're sausage. freaked out about snakes, this is this is not uh, really weird. A um, little bit of spice, lots of onions. If you like grilled onions, you might like this. Now, uh, since you didn't want to eat that, I'm going to give you something that you're really not going to want to eat, which is vegan mac and cheese. So since 2016, uh, the Rangers have been serving vegan products. And cheese, as we know, is a dairy product. When you're vegan, you don't eat meat and you don't eat animal products, which means that that ain't cheese. It's not, but... Interestingly, this is a little bit spicy. You know, if you were to make like a hatch chili mac or something, something in their cheese, which is a cashew-based cheese, uh, is a tiny bit spicy. You getting that? What is it? Cash it's cashew-based? Cashew-based cheese. There's nothing wrong with it. Would you order it? Probably not. I'm with them on that. Ooh, let's do these brisket egg rolls. This was a Twitter contest, you guys. So a fan came up with these egg rolls. They're smoking this brisket in-house, stuffing it inside a wrapper, deep frying it, and serving it with Sweet Baby Ray's barbecue sauce. I also am a fan of the big egg roll. Uh, I love egg rolls. So I do too. Let's see what we've got here. I did, is it sir? It is served with rice, apparently. It does come with a side of rice. Rice is not a portable food. It's not really ballpark food. It's a great point. You can take or leave the rice. What do you think about the brisket? Evan also loves barbecue like I do. We've eaten some good barbecue around Texas. What's how's this rank? Um, it's good, uh, and it, it, the, what I will say is, if you go to your local Chinese restaurant, I'm gonna take a bite of the big one. Mm, good. If you go to your local Chinese restaurant, you get very little protein in your egg rolls, right? It's mostly cabbage. Uh huh. Carrots. Okay, so. He's always good for the big bite. Evan, that's, I love doing this, this with you. This is full of brisket. Good point. So there is a good brisket to vegetable ratio. Uh huh. I like these a lot. I would say that I like these. It's the most bites that Evan has taken so far of any of these foods. Okay. And I think that is noteworthy. Where are we going now? I'm really excited about this. And then we're gonna save the best for last. This, you guys, it's a foot long hot dog with jalapeno grits on top. Which is very weird. Of all the things to put on top of a hot dog, jalapeno grits. Also chili, pico, and my one of my favorite foods in the entire world, fake nacho cheese. What are we thinking? Oh. Okay. Um, you go first. So grits are squishy without a lot of texture. That's a weird topping for a hot dog. The flavor of the jalapeno cheese is nice. 
Jalapeno cheese on a hot dog is good. And I believe these are the Nolan Ryan all beef hot dogs. So it's, it's a good hot dog. Um, but yeah, you add some squish on top of an already squishy bun. And while you get some flavor, you have a weirdo texture, in I, my opinion. I, it tastes really good. And the jalapeno cheese grits are good. I, the thing for me on a hot dog and on any kind of sausage is you want that snap, right? Uh-huh. I like that that snap. I like my hot dogs a little bit charred off the grill uh -huh. so that they snap a little bit more. And so the one thing I think about the jalapeno cheese grits is that they do kind of, uh, you they lose a little bit that. of that. Yeah. Okay, um, so here, right now, these look just like regular nachos, okay? Yeah, no but big thing. that's not what you're gonna get in the stands when you order the stack. Look at, oh, let me show this this side because look at this cheese drip. This is more of that cheese I'm telling you. There's nothing wrong with that. Do you see this? It's like, eat me. Ah. So you would take oh, here. this supposedly out. It's very heavy, okay. And then you would take each tostada and put it on the level and then you have your own individual tostada. And then maybe you hold the tostada like this and get cheese all over the bottom of your hands. But and you here, eat it Sarah, like a hamster. Let's do I'm this. I'm not buying it. Let's do this, okay? We can try? This is, here, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna share this. <laughs> okay. So, which side do you want? I like this side right here. Okay, so I'm gonna bite in from this side. Okay, this is like Lady in the Trap. Don't knock, yeah, it is. Okay, yeah, keep it balanced. Uh-oh, I got to punch him. <laughs> I'm here to say it's not really shareable. Um, it's a lot of fun, though. I mean, part of the fun of the ballpark, I feel like, is getting this wacko food and then figuring out how to eat it, using your fork, using 47 napkins if you have to. So this is one of those foods. It is essentially, I want to tell everybody out there, nachos. Look, if you're looking for nachos with a lot of stuff in it, these are them. This is it, but you're, this is how you're gonna have to eat it, and you're gonna get cheese on your fingers, yep. just like you would with regular nachos, but you're gonna have to break it off a little bit at a time. Yep. Or, hopefully you have a date as nice as Sarah with you, and you get to share it like Lady in the Tramp. Definitely yeah, do best the brisket bite. Evan. egg roll. Is that your best bite? Probably, yeah. Okay, brisket egg roll for Evan. Um, I give a lot of creativity to the, to the, um, Grit dog, I just, huh? again, the biggest issue for me on, on the grit dog is going to be coming down to the texture that the grits add to it. They add a lot of flavor. Texture-wise, it's a little bit creamy. Yep. The vegan mac and cheese is, I think, quite good for, for a vegan dish. Um, yeah, it does the job. The stack wins for best visual, yeah. but it also, also wins for most difficult to consume. Yes. The brisket egg rolls were my favorite bite as well. All right, that wraps us up. We're here at Globe Life Field. Uh, we hope you get to come and try some of this food too. I'm Sarah, this is Evan. Bye. I'm eating. <laughs>